The tribe has a proud veteran population. The Wedase American Legion Post is a source of enormous pride for the Prairie Band. Wedase translates as warrior in English, and the tribe has a proud tradition of warriors in the past and devotes attention to honoring those in the present. It was founded by 10 Native American members in 1989. We've grown to 81 members at this time. Our primary uh, objective and function is to uh, transport veterans to and from their appointments, whether it's at the VA or me other medical appointments in Topeka, Leavenworth, Kansas City, and Wichita. That's our, our one of our primary objectives. Second one is to uh, provide a full military burial for any veteran that passes away here on the reservation. And that was the reason why the post was formed. On the memorial wall, we, we have uh, 378 names. And uh, out of that, there's nine of them that were killed in action. One was a prisoner of war. And that's through current conflicts. Approximately 10% of the Prairie Man Potawatomi Nation's adult population has served in the armed, armed forces. So that uh, that's pretty... Uh, that's the highest percentage in, in uh, any nationality in the United States. Here at Shipshe Cemetery, we have the first uh, Prairie Band Potawatomi Indian killed in World War I, buried at this cemetery out here. And that happened on November the 5th in 1917. So uh, we were preparing a plaque, and, uh, I mean a plaque for that, and and to recognize his, his unfortunate, but, but uh, they served in uh, every conflict. We've had people that served in every conflict from World War I, World War II, uh, Korea, Vietnam, and then present conflicts also.